collection of 3,000 previously unseen old photographs of the Irish travelling community have been handed over today to the National Folklore Collection. The photographs were taken by two American university students who lived on a halting site in Dublin for two years in the early 1970s. It was truly hands-on student research when George and Sharon Gamelch moved into a barrel-top wagon with the travelling community in Dublin in 1970. Anne Donegan is the daughter of one of the men befriended by the American couple who documented the life of this traveller community at a time when many of those they met didn't read or write or have cameras. It means the world to me because my mother has passed away, my father has passed away and I can't believe that I got my hands on the photos from years ago to be honest with you. My mother always spoke of George and Sharon and my mother always spoke highly of them. They were living with my mother and father years ago in wagons. Those photographs, so precious to Anne, have now been handed over to the National Folklore Collection here at UCD, home to one of the world's biggest collections of social history material. It's a very exciting collection to receive and it will really augment and complement the National Folklore Collection here at UCD. These photographs have a very special quality to them and it's a very sizeable collection also, so it's very important for us to receive them. The Gamelches have donated 3,000 photos featuring the Connors, Donoghue and Maughan families. Forty years after the project and several books on the travelling community later, the students are now university professors and have retraced their steps as part of a new documentary. Katrina Perry, RTE News.